Hello Libras, I hope you are doing well. Let me just get a sip of water here. I'm drinking lemon water in my soup container. <laughs> my favorite size containers to drink from, to be honest. Okay, so any info you need will be below, including the link to my website. I'm going to get right into your reading. Thank you so much for joining me. This will include your past, present, and future with some clarification and we'll see like do you get advice do you get a message what do you get it is up to the cards okay libra I do want to say thank you one more time for being here i really appreciate you let's begin what libras okay let's try it again libras please past a lot of cards coming out at once well it's just two okay i thought it was more Okay, Libras, hmm. you could be dealing with an air sign like yourself, Gemini, Aquarius, or a Libra. And, you know, the first energy's energy coming out here is that there may have been some sort of an ending. We have the Ten of Pentacles, and we have the Ace of Swords popping up. One more. Okay, there we go. To the Nine of Pentacles. So clearly someone has become single. Someone has walked away from a relationship, some sort of... To be honest, it's something that wasn't working. So whether it's this person that walked away from you or that they walked away from a marriage that wasn't working, it wasn't working. Okay, so I'm getting more of the card of a marriage because that just fell out. I'm going to leave that other card on the floor. That was actually the Four of Wands. Four of Wands in this deck is a card about things not working out between two people. So this is in your recent past. Um, there could have been some clarity and someone realized like, hey, it looks like it may have been a masculine and the masculine realized, hey, this isn't working. I got to go. OK, so present, we'll see what's coming up and we will clarify all of this to um, understand it best. Right. Oh, wow. Double wish energy here for me in this card. Um, so what I get here is someone started going towards a wish. That they had not, you know, they stopped going towards it before. I will say we have the signs of Cancer, Aquarius, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus um, here, if that's relevant for any of you. But the one thing, also Leo and Aries is here. Um, I see someone went for a burning desire that they were not taking action towards. We're going to have to clarify that more. It could be a person that someone's going towards. It could be a air sign that's it could be someone coming towards you obviously libra okay um let's go in the future and then when we clarify more we'll understand that better well actually let's go okay let's see no nothing flips so let's get one more card for this present time i mean there's no limit to the cards we can take i don't know why i'm stopping like i have to like I have to stop. So it looks like someone is going towards a wish. And what this wish is, is a reunion with someone um, or somewhere where they have fun. And it looks like it could be a fire sign coming towards you is what I'm going to say. Um, even if it's like, can we go for drinks? Like someone's coming in towards you and that's a wish that they want is to come to you. And they weren't doing it in the past for some reason. Okay. So let's go in the future. Four of Cups. I don't think you'll see this coming in, Libra. You may have actually put this to rest, um, fully thinking like this is not coming. You may fully not believe, but guess what? It is. The perception has changed. And also what may have happened or what may be happening in the near future is you may go from not believing to believing. You may change your perception where you say, oh, this couldn't work. And then it it can, like you say, oh, it can. And then guess what? It probably does. Yeah, look at that new beginning after an ending. So after like you really giving up, oh no, the growth was not ending. It was just starting, you know, that's when the growth happens. So let's clarify this beautiful message, Libra. Let's see what's coming up for you. Ace of Swords. So, yeah, I mean, it's the cold, hard truth. We're getting the Knight of Swords in reverse. You came to clarity, and then you had to say what you had to say. It probably caused an argument. Ooh, we almost have the Page of Swords in reverse. You may have even said some things that weren't very kind, or you may have just spoken quickly, like too quickly. Anyways, you got yourself single, or someone got themselves single here. Yeah, they let go of a toxic situation. They let it all out by the looks of it, by the sounds of it. They just spoke up, and it's... 
it's it is what it is okay and the reason they spoke up was to go to their truest desire and i'm guessing that is you so i am seeing okay very interesting let's see what we have here at libra someone coming back after maybe abandoning you and it's taken them quite some time um this person was involved in a, a marriage that was very toxic is what i'm getting here this person is very passionate. They definitely want to be intimate with you. Um, they also want to bring stability in towards you because that's what you deserve. And here we have the Ace of Pentacles telling you that's what you deserve. And that's what this person actually wants to offer you. Um, there's a lot of love here for you as well, okay? Because you have the Ace of Cups here. Anything that? Like Let's see. I'm seeing the Sun card. I'm seeing the justice in reverse and the king of wands. I feel like it belongs right here. This person going through, uh, when this person was separate, it's because they couldn't take action during the court case. Like literally, it's something like that. Okay. Um, they couldn't get caught. It's, and they didn't want anyone to find out or something like that, that they had someone else they wanted to be with or somewhere else they wanted to be with. They just wanted to end everything in that other situation before they came back to you so they can give you like the clear, honest truth. Okay. So let's move forward where, you know, this change happens. So we have this moon card where at first I think you're feeling in the dark thinking this isn't going to happen. And then you start getting hopeful I'm telling you, you start getting your power back. Um, we have the star card with the queen of wands. So I feel honest to goodness, Libra, once you got your power back and started getting in the swing of things again, you know, it was a slow, it was a slow procedure is what I'm going to say. And you didn't see a lot of things going on in the background, but all along, this is leading to a beautiful new unexpected beginning and possible reunion with someone who you let go of. That's the plain and simple truth. You got yourself out of your head about this connection. One more card. The Queen of Pentacles in reverse and the hangman and the devil and the higher. There has been someone released from a marriage, a toxic marriage. I'm going to say tower card. How much more do we have to go? How much more further, right? And that person was in pause for some time because I'm seeing the four of swords sticking out. Um, that person was in some pause with the Hierophant, doing their own thing, but here they are coming towards their desire, towards what they truly want, um, probably to have a new cycle with you, okay? So let's get a beautiful card from this beautiful deck I just got. It was a gift from an anonymous person because this time Amazon didn't give me your name or any info. So I want to say thank you so much for the mystic um, messages, I believe it's called. I love it. I don't know why I'm saying uh, wisdom, not messages. Um, okay, let's see what we get here. I love it. Thank you so much. Legends, learn from those who inspire you. Maybe that's what this person had to do. Maybe they had to look back at people that inspired them. What I get more so is like follow your intuition. Like I feel like this person was inspired by other people's failures. Like I don't want to be there. I don't want to do that. But you choose whatever it means to you. That's what I really think there with that. Anyhow, Libras, I wish you the best on your journey. I hope you're doing well. Um, this is very intense energy. But, you know, this is life and this is part of all of the unexpected twists and turns that can happen. Um, and, yeah, it looks like you had a big change or a big glow up would probably be the best way to put that. Going from the Four of Cups to... The Queen of Wands, that is a big deal. Some of you may have Leo energy hidden in your chart you don't even know. Um, or maybe your mom's a Leo. I don't know. Bye for now. Ciao.